this fight, um, I thought Pedraza was probably one of the best. That was one of the best Pedrazas I've ever seen. So going back to you saying Loma was good, but for him it wasn't great. I think you, got, you give credit for Pedraza for that. Yeah, that's that's the that's the fine line, you know. How yeah. much was Loma and how much was Pedraza? Yeah, uh, it's tough, and I don't want to take right. away from Pedraza because he could have packed it in several times and didn't do it, especially after that 11th round. Right, he got up, he bit down, and he, he came forward in the 12th. So, you know, I think it was a combination. Okay. I think it was a combination of maybe, you know, Loma not being as sharp as he typically would be. Yeah. I mean, he was sharp, but just not as sharp. Yeah. And Pedraza, you know, putting up a great fight and last, giving him some resistance. My last question is, like, as someone who used to fight, and, and I'm sure you do this the same thing, when, you, when you're watching fighters in the back of your mind, it's like, well, how would I want to fight him? How would I fight him? How would I beat him? Like, how would you beat a Lomachenko? Like, I can't I figure know. that out. I don't know. <laughs> Well, I mean, <laughs> it's hard, it's hard. For me, that's not that's not even realistic, you know, because of the weight difference. So maybe I'm in a minority, but I don't I, like I don't even really think about it, you know. Okay. I don't even think about it. Now, if he was like heavy crews or somebody that I know realistically, I could have fought probably with him. Dre, any any, any, any yeah. chance? Yeah. Dre, any chance you come out to fight Usyk out of retirement? And I'm chilling right now, man. Yeah. What do you I'm think of Usyk? It's gonna take a lot to make that what happen. What do you think of Usyk though? Huh? What do you think of Usyk? What's up? Did you, I remember you said before the fight, you, you were worried about Bellew's weight in that fight. You thought yeah, it could, yeah, yeah. did it show you up? You saw what happened. Yeah, he hit a wall. He hit a wall. You can't do it. You can't do it. He hit a wall. You can't do it. You go up like that, you can't come down. If you blow up and you're fat and out of shape, that's different. But if you if you've campaigned there for a fight, two fights, two or three training camps, you can't come down. And then how's it feel being the movie star again? <laughs> <laughs> hey, it was good, man. It was good. What y'all think about that hill? I got, I got to see it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah, you were a badass in part one, though. You were like the coldest scene in part one. No bullshit. I appreciate it, yeah. man. I appreciate it. You walked in, you were like, I want some. Yeah. I was like, I, I yelled at you. follow the script. That's all. I was like, that's SOG. Yeah. That's Danny's Stuntman Wheeler.